Hi, it's Gary from Gary's Lens Photography. I've got a little photography hack for you here. You know, sometimes you get gear and you use it and it gets abused and then it falls apart. Especially if you buy cheap gear like this little guy. Now the reason I bought this in the first place was it was small, it was handy, it could be packed away really quick, it was a little tripod. Uh, so for a light camera, when I'm on the move and when I'm out there, uh, it was really handy to have. Uh, it extended pretty long and um, the little uh, flip top was great too. I could flip it open for different angles. It was a very good little tripod. The only problem is that eventually the little screw that holds your camera on it, it broke off and uh, got lost. So um, it's kind of useless now as a tripod. So here's a quick little hack. You know, um, even though a lot of these tripods, the, the heads don't actually come off, um, they do if you, of course, break it. So I'm gonna actually break it. The little knob that uh, is on the side here, we've got two knobs on here. One, uh, of course, the, the handle that loosens it up. You can uh, move it up and down. Um, but there's another little knob on the other side here as well that uh, adjusts the tension. And if you were to unscrew that entirely, I'm gonna take it right on out here. Okay, so we take that right off. Now the, uh, the head still uh, is attached. It still doesn't come off. But if you have a look inside, I don't know if we can get close enough to see. Yeah, there you go. You can see there's a tiny little screw in there. So I'm just going to grab a screwdriver and I'm going to go ahead and uh, take that screw out. There you go. So the screw's out. And now, um, just like that, the head will pop off. Now, um, this uh, has parts, of course, that you can keep. If you want to hang on to the handle, you never know when that might come in handy. Uh, you can pull that off. Uh, you might be able to use that for a handle for something else. So I'm a pack rat. I like to keep things. So we're going to hang on to that. We'll just uh, put that to the side and maybe put that in my junk drawer. This little piece, though, because that other piece is missing, uh, really not going to do me a lot of good. I know it's, it's kind of cool the way it flipped, um, but not much good. So we'll just toss that. The tripod, though, now if you have a look at the very end of it, um, has this cool spindle on the top. Uh, that is really cool because that's the right size to be able to put other accessories on. And that's what I'm going to show you here now. So the reason I did that is because when I take that head off, I go and grab one of my uh, little light or uh, hot shoe type mounts that comes uh, to fit on the top of a light stand. And that now fits right on the top of there and I can screw that tight. So there you go. Now I have a hot shoe mounted on the tripod where it wasn't working before. And I can go ahead then and take my lights. Uh, here I just have a remote attached to a regular flash and there you go. It's mounted on there and onto the tripod. And the tripod can be extended of course as it always did because that part wasn't broken thankfully. And I can set that up now as a quick light stand. So there you go, it gives me a really cool off-camera flash light stand that can be packed up nice and compact and I don't have to throw out the whole tripod.